everyone! The other day I posted on my Instagram story and asked you guys to send in your unpopular opinions about Star Stable. I'm going to read them and tell you what I think, if I agree or disagree. First of all, I need to figure out what horse I'm training because I don't know. I'm losing my voice already. There's Flora I could train or there's Spike. I don't know, I think I should do Spike. Maybe I can do both of them. I don't think this shirt is the same color pink. I saw someone wear this, this shirt, this one shirt with this saddle pad and I'm copying them. Then I just have these breeches that don't even match anything. You know what? It's fine. As long as I'm training, nothing else matters. Oh, the Yorvik Stables Championship. Not going to that. The first unpopular opinion is Alex is overhyped and I dislike how they changed Rockstar Lisa to some country chick. What happened to her? I don't really care enough about Lisa to care whether or not she's country or a rock star. Alex is very overhyped. I agree with that. I think it's because they made her seem like Billie Eilish. Billie Eilish is very popular, right? Oh, we went up a level. She's very popular right now. Alex used to be my favorite soul rider and I, I related to the fact that she had so many brothers. Mistfall might be pretty, but it's the worst area. I agree with you. Well, I don't agree that it's pretty. I think it looks like a swamp. I feel like a lot of people do really like Mistfall. SSO should remake the quarters so they don't glitch faster. That is a really unpopular opinion. If you talk to any racer, they would freak out. Gosh. SSO racing is kind of a disaster. I actually really dislike the Frisians. I got this one a lot, actually. I really like the Frisians, though. I only have two Frisian sport horses. I don't have an actual black Frisian of the new model. Maya should go back to May. That stupid... I don't know why her name got changed. I thought May was a really pretty name, and I think Maya's fine too. It's just why. Same with that little creepy child. Her name was Lisa, and now it's something else. I don't know what it is. They definitely changed it because Lisa, the soul rider, is the star of the entire game now. It's like she's the game's mascot. Picking up the for chores is the best thing ever. Okay, that's definitely an unpopular opinion. Who thinks that doing the chores on Star Stable is even fun? I don't want SSO to add male characters. I don't know whether a bunch of people want male characters or not. I wouldn't mind having them. Riding horses isn't really a popular sport for boys, I guess. It would be nice if they were represented more in the sport. I do get that the storyline in this game is about a girl, though. I don't like the updated Silverglade look, Mistfall style. It looks fake to me. Rip. The new s what's- what's going on over there? I think the new style has grown on me. I used to be really against it. I didn't like this new style and now I feel like it goes with the game a lot better. What? Why is there black stuff now? Are you serious? Everyone's like, turn your shadows on and off and I'm like, I don't want to. I'm too lazy to do that. Old models are still cute. I do not agree with you. I, I think some of the old models, they look like spiders. They look scary. Pinky is a hypocrite because she made fun of Maddie for selling horses and then continued, she goes and sells so many. I made fun of Maddie for selling horses because she sold really nice horses. I sold old model horses that weren't so great once I didn't even ride. Oh, the new tack isn't that nice and way too pricey. I don't agree with you on that because, I don't know, I like the tack. I think this all definitely fits our character better because our character is really small and this saddle is giant. Look at how much space, like the seat is way too big and this saddle is very, it's more appropriately sized. Yeah, they are a lot of star coins, but it's not like they're only star coins. Like you have an option if you want to save your shillings, which is nice because shillings don't cost real money. Might as well take advantage of that. Star Stable archeology span was actually kind of fun. 
No, it wasn't. It wasn't fun. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry, but you're full of- Who on a horse game wants to go dig for dinosaur bones for hours and hours? And hours. Not on a horse game. We have to go fishing in this horse game. Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? I'm still Team Idris after seeing the new James and Maya story takeover. Oh my gosh, the new James? I think the new James is pretty nice looking. I don't know if this is an unpopular opinion, but the Welsh ponies are kind of weird looking. I don't see a lot of people riding the Welsh ponies, even though I think they're really cute. I really like training horses for literally hours. I think you're insane. Dressage clubs are overrated, even though I own one. Mm, I don't know, I like watching them, but then actually doing their dressage and doing the moves and stuff, it's so complicated to me. I don't think I'm talented enough to be in a dressage club ever. The new Akultex are the worst horses to come out. I hate them so much. For some reason, I can say the Shinko Teagues and the Akultex, a lot of people don't like those horses. I feel like I'll like the Akultex better when more colors come out. Shires are absolute trash and don't deserve to be horses. Same with Clydesdales. <laughs> You're actually pretty funny. <laughs> I agree about the Shires. I do enjoy the Clydesdales. I think they're pretty nice. I do think that's an unpopular opinion though. Jorvik wild horses shouldn't have been added to Star Stable. Love your vids. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. Personally, I never ride my Jorvik Wild Horses. I have I have the three original ones, and then I think I have five, and I don't ride any of them, and I don't see a lot of people riding them either. I don't know. You might be right. The starters don't look like the Trackner. I think the starters and the Trackners are kind of similar. Not that I care. They're horses. They're warm bloods. They are going to look similar. Horses are horses. They should have an option to not have 24 hour clock. I don't know if that's unpopular though. I agree with you. This is a game. It's not real life where it's going to get dark out, you know what I mean? Steve's is one of the worst home stables. I agree with you. Steve's is a very busy place for some reason, and it's the most ugliest barn ever. Actually, I do like Silverglade Village. I think they're planning on redoing it soon, so it might not be that bad. Stable care is really helpful and not too expensive. Could be worse. I don't agree with you. I think stable care is a star coin sucker upper. It will steal your star coins. I think our SSO characters look like Voldemort from Side On. Okay, I've never heard that one before. I don't see Voldemort. Do our characters look like Voldemort? Maybe. There should be more appreciation towards Shires and way more cross-country races. I don't agree with you. I don't like the Shires. Almost every race in this entire game is a cross-country race. I'm doing a cross-country race right now. The disco needs to be on more often. I don't really go to the disco anymore. I'm not, oh, are you serious? I don't really have an opinion on that. I hate Anne and the Souls, the Souls Riders, except for Linda. I feel like Linda is underrated. I don't know. I feel like Linda doesn't get appreciated enough. Where am I going? She's the brains behind everything that the soul riders do and she's just really important i don't really hate Anne. i just feel like she's also underrated for some reason it's like alex and lisa have taken over mostly lisa i feel like lisa gets way too much spotlight i just wish the other soul riders would have like more of a chance to shine because they're all equals i don't like how lisa is the ringleader of everything i personally don't really like any of the pants in SSO. They look bulky at the waist. I don't think they're bulky at the waist. I think our characters- I don't want to start talking about body shapes. I think we should be able to have different body type options. Oh yay. What- what's going on? That's nice. <laughs> this one- this one makes me die. James looks like a tomb. <laughs> 
James looks like a two-year-old drug dealer. <laughs> And his new self makes him look like a 15 year old robber. <laughs> oh my gosh. You know what? I think the old James does look creepy. This whole video is just starting to get so weird. I don't know. I think that our character's hands look like fish sticks. I'll go home. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Now I'm disgusted. Deborah, I did not appreciate that unpopular opinion because now I'm going to be disgusted every time I look at my character's fingers. So thanks for that. Deborah. The soundtrack for Dundle is kind of creepy. I don't think it's that creepy. Oh my gosh. I hate how they do a new deal every weekend. Honestly, let's do 15% off because everyone's gonna buy Star Rider. And like, oh my god, special deal. It's not that great of a deal. Like, chill out. Deals like that aren't special when you do the deal all the time. Deals are great and all, discounts are great, but it could be better, it could be more special. They could do a better deal less often, how about that? Star coins are reasonably priced. That is definitely an unpopular opinion. Most people think that star coins are extremely expensive. This person kills me. Star Stable needs fantasy. Star Stable needs fantasy. I'm talking unicorns. Star Stable shouldn't cost money. <laughs> That's random. The occasional, oh, my horse has wings and can fly. I think that's fun, but I live for the realistic things. Oh, I failed. I would rather have them make a big horse show where we can all compete against each other and be judged and it wouldn't be a race than to have Cloud Kingdom come back, for example. I think some people like it to be real because a lot of people cannot own a horse in real life. They do not have the privilege to own a horse in real life. It's very difficult to own a horse in real life or even ride horses in real life or even take lessons or any of that. It's nice to have a piece of that in a game. I don't think it's bad to starve your horses. I agree with you. I get comments like this all the time because you guys know I don't really care for my horses that much. The thing is, they're just pixels. This is just a game. It's not like they're going to die. This is not real life. This is just a game. So if I don't want to take care of my pixels, I don't have to take care of my pixels. The dapple gray Connie is cross-eyed. Is it? Open your eyes. He's like, I don't want to. You're going to call me cross-eyed. I don't notice anything. I think he looks fine. I don't want bitless bridles. My opinion on that is I feel like we should have bitless just as an option, but I feel like we should also have D-ring bits, egg butt bits. Everyone rides differently, so it would just be nice to have options. Oh, someone said star coins suck. Don't put this next part in the video. I love star coins. It's just for the video. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. I just put it in the video, so tough luck. Maybe I should put that in the thumbnail just for fun. Star coins suck. Everybody click on this video because star coins suck. I think every single one of the characters are ugly except Mrs. Holdsworth. Why? <laughs> the characters have an abnormally large lump on their backs. You know what? I think it's just because they don't have good posture. Am I the only one that thinks the characters should be able to jump? I don't think so, honestly. In the CD games, like the Summer Riders, Spring Riders, we could press a space bar. I don't know why our characters would need to jump. What would our characters jump on? I would like to pick up after my horses. Okay, that's, that's good to hear. Spirit is scary because he has eyebrows. I think the eyebrows on Spirit just, you know, make him look so much better. I think he just looks fancy and nice. It's a scam. Some people actually do believe that Star Stable is a scam. Oh. <sighs> okay, I'm done. I don't like most of the pets, like, at all. They're just really pointless, in my opinion. I think they're there just to be cute. Spirit can lead James Charles in an eyebrow tutorial. See, someone knows what's up. 
To be honest, the Arabian model still looks like a spider. I agree with you. I think both Arabian models are just terrible. I think they don't represent the breed well at all. I don't think cars should be a part of SSO. It's a horse game and it should stay a horse game. Well, it could still be a horse game with cars. For some reason, I really hate that one Bobcats girl who rides up and down like Moreland Road. Why? Why are you just annoyed at someone riding around? I don't- I don't get it. Well, she's doing no stirrups. Maybe you don't like Arabians. I honestly hate the new chestnut jumping saddle. Me too, it's orange. I think that the Zoni is not overrated. It's so cute and the noises it makes are adorable. Oh my gosh, I used to have Zuzu pets and then my hair got stuck in the wheels and I threw them away because I got very upset. I think that the Zoni sounds like my Zuzu pets that I used to have and it scares me so much. So, you know, I don't have a Zoni. I feel like everybody has a Zoni for some reason. Jasper hasn't got an update. I want a hot, I just missed a checkpoint. This girl is distracting me by saying Jasper's hot. Poor Jasper. I think Jasper is underrated. Loretta, what is going on with your rain, sister? Does anyone else see this? I see that. Can I have Loretta's horse? I want her horse. Her horse is so nice. Star Stable is kind of boring sometimes. A lot of people would agree with you on that. I don't think that's an unpopular opinion because when you run out of quests, there aren't that many things to do and people make their own things to do like role playing or doing stuff with their club if you're not a big creative person and you can't come up with your own things to do other than quests i can see why this game would be really boring being in a club is totally overrated and it's way better to be clubless mm -hmm. I don't agree with you. Without a club, I just, oh my gosh, I don't know what I would do without a club. Having a club is so nice because when you're on Star Stable, there's someone to talk to, unless you're in a dead club. Maybe you've had a bad club experience, I have no idea. A lot of clubs have events. You just feel like you belong in the game. I don't know, I just like having a club. I know there's people who do prefer being alone though. I think that it is stupid that when you do quests, the people talk too much. Ooh, that's such a good one. I agree on that. I can get so bored with the quest sometimes because it feels like you're not doing anything when all you do is talk to people and there's no action, which is a lot of the quests on this game. It can get boring really quickly. Star Stable needs to remove the horses from the game. Are you trolling me? I feel like I'm getting trolled. <laughs> Did I just miss a checkpoint? Wait, someone told me you can back up into it and you'll get it. Let's see. Let's see if that works. It does! Thanks whoever said that to me because you just saved my life. The horses need more food choices. Where's the grain? Where's the oats? Jasper is fat and ugly. You know what? I don't like you. That is the end of this training time. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time. Bye! Thank you.